Okay. I'm ready for bed. Could you go wait for me? I'll be right there. Okay. No, Miguel. I can't be with you. I made a deal with Julian, and you can never know. Darling, I can't wait. Come to bed. Yeah, of course. Wait, wait, Look, wait. Miguel, we're all real glad and happy that you got out of prison, right? But it's late now. My wife and I need some alone time together. Got it? So good night. I guess we'll see you in the morning. Okay, wait, wait. Listen, there's something, Kane, I need to tell you, and you need to hear it now. Well, what is it, Miguel? Because I'd really like to get to bed. If you want me to have Miguel set free, I want you to stay married and faithful to my son, specifically. Never see Miguel again. Listen, Fox, you know this isn't going to be easy for either one of us. But there's something you need to know. Okay, something both of us need to tell you. Well, I'm sure it can wait until the morning. No, he's right. What Miguel is, is trying to say is, from both of us, thank you. Thank you to you and your father. You know, I have to understand it's very hard for Miguel to say thank you to the cranes. Well, I don't know why. Oh, I do. Maybe because it was what because... What if it weren't for you and, and your father, he would still be in prison. Mm. Fox put me in prison, Kay. Yeah, but he made a mistake. I did. And, uh... Miguel, there's no really easy way to express this in words, but, um... I'm sorry. But I really did think that it was you driving the car that ran me down. Oh, I'll bet. <laughs> well, hell... <laughs> It was your car. Who knew that your double was gonna steal it and run me over with it? Yeah, well, luckily, Julian found Spike and made him testify to Judge Riley and said that you weren't driving, so now you're free, and that's all that matters. Uh, no. Maria has her father back, and that's all that's important. You don't mean that? Yeah, that's exactly what I mean. Maria's well-being is all I care about, so. So, um... Why don't we just forget this whole thing, huh? I mean, I'm just happy that this nightmare's over for all of us. Okay. Good night, Well, why don't we go to bed, darling? Of course. Good night, Miguel. What the hell is going on? Up, huh? Yeah, barely even bothers me anymore. And if it keeps me alive, then thank God for it. Now, I want to make love to my gorgeous wife. What, you're feeling well enough? Are you kidding me? Yes. You know, it's funny to me how you managed to overcome all those treatments. <laughs> but they were supposed to make you impotent. You're not taking those pills again, are you? No. It's just you, Kay. I'd better be a total flop with another woman. Sweet. You know, I'm just gonna take a hot shower first, though. Okay. Please, just give me one minute. <sighs> okay, one minute. But please hurry back, because I want to spend whatever moments I have left with you. I'm sorry. Miguel, I'm sorry. 